Hi, I'm Tim. Welcome to Watch You Want, and thanks for logging on. Today we're looking at the Vacheron Constantin Patrimony, reference 81180 in 18 karat white gold, 40 millimeters across. This Vacheron Constantin is, like all of the watches on our YouTube channel, actual inventory in stock and available for immediate purchase and delivery on our retail website, watchyouwant.com. And if you like getting the latest luxury watch news, views, and reviews in daily video format, please subscribe to our YouTube channel, Watch You Want Inc. Now, this is another watch that I've had on before, but I'd like to revisit because just a few days ago I was responding to some of the comments on our YouTube channel and someone was asking why you would ever want a Geneva seal movement with a solid case back. And I felt like the logic of this watch kind of had to be revisited. But first I want to talk about the fit and the feel for those of you who are experiencing this watch on our channel for the first time. The Vacheron Constantin Patrimony, formerly the Patrimony Contemporain, feels absolutely wafer-like on the wrist. Now 40 millimeters, it's a modern size, but its proportions, that is the relation of one part to another, are very much classical. It's also very easy to wear on a small wrist. Now you can see my wrist, six and a third inches, 16 centimeters in circumference, is relatively undersized by the standards of a guy's wrist, but typical in profile, being oval in cross section, flattish across the top. And realistically, if you're into a very traditional dress style, you can't do much better than this. This watch is comfortable, it's thin, it's beautifully built, and it's timeless in its taste. Its fit and finish is self-evident in person, but if the iPhone is stealing any of the effect, let me elaborate. This watch on the wrist probably only projects upward about three and a half to four millimeters. Now, in total, it's only 6.8 millimeters thick, and with a slightly curved case back, it nestles down even lower than that. Extremely compact lug to lug, Vacheron borrows a page from the sports watch playbook and pairs down the lugs. They're curved, they're short, and they barely project beyond the end of the case. So the dominant feature of this watch aesthetically is that broad silvered dial. Now you can see that the strap is also minimally bolstered. Alligator on the top, beautiful, incredibly supple, contrasting stitched calf skin on the back. This is as flexible and soft and silky as you would expect a Geneva seal dress watch strap to be. And while the pin buckle is simple and traditional, it's also beautifully made with a finish befitting a manufacturer of this caliber. Now when I talked about the Geneva seal on a solid case back dress watch and some of the questions I received, it bears mentioning that thinness is a virtue in and of itself and the finish of a movement traditionally in Swiss watchmaking was a mark of integrity. It wasn't something to be oogled necessarily, it was something that the watchmaker, the manufacturer did to show its competence to the next watchmaker who would experience that movement, which is why the case back of this watch is solid. That also has benefits for the ultra thin construction, namely without a display case back the watch can be made thinner. If you look at some of the ultra thin references over the last decade from companies like Jezur Lecoult, Vacheron, Constantin, Piaget, you'll realize that a solid case back imparts additional rigidity to the case and a sapphire case back is actually going to be slightly thicker. So if you want the thinnest, most elegant, lowest profile ultra thin, you want a solid case back. More than that, it does add real value to the watch. From a practical standpoint, synthetic sapphire is relatively cheap to manufacture these days. It's nothing compared to roughly half an ounce of actual 18 karat gold. Now there is one element that I want to highlight right here, which is this little mark just below my thumb, and that is the new Geneva Seal Standard. This watch features the post-2012, effectively a standard practice as of 2013, but the dial, the case, and the movement are now subject to the standards of Geneva Seal inspection and finish. Part of the industry's response to the 2009 emergence of the Patek Philippe seal, a standard that Patek Philippe, of course, insisted apply to every element of the assembled watch, by abandoning the Geneva seal, they were effectively slighting that standard. So the Geneva seal, in conjunction with Vacheron Constantin, sort of hit back. They raised their game, they raised their standard, and now you see the Ponson de Genève on the case itself, as well as on the movement itself. So let's talk a little bit about the movement. Caliber 1400, this is one of Vacheron Constantin's initial in-house movements. Many are surprised to learn that prior to the 21st century, VC almost never built its own movements. Not really a manufacturer so much as a 
very fine finisher. They would add most of the value to the movement by making it beautiful, by making it fine, by making it a work of art, not necessarily by engineering it in the technical sense. No more. The caliber 1400 is entirely in-house, ultra thin, only 2.6 millimeters thick. It's only comprised of 98 parts, of which 20 are synthetic ruby jewels used for the pivots. In-house Geneva seal standard, everything is gorgeous, and it beats at a modern 4 hertz, or 28,800 vibrations per hour. Now, granted, being an ultra-thin watch, it's only protected by 30 ATM, or essentially splash water resistance, and a 40-hour power reserve does mean you're going to need to wind it up daily. But I can tell you that the tactile sensation of winding this movement in this watch is absolutely exquisite. It's going to be quality time, not a chore, on a daily basis. So therein lies the logic of this Vacheron Constantin Patrimony. Reference 81180, 18 karat white gold, and a modern 40 millimeters across. It harks to the best of the ultra-thin Vacheron Constantin references of the past. Watches like the reference 6351 or the 6115. Classical in its imagery, modern in its standard of finish and its engineering, this Vacheron Constantin Patrimony, 40 millimeters in 18 karat white gold, can be seen and purchased on our retail website, watchyouwant.com.